what is up this weather is exactly what i've been wanting for like the whole summer literally perfect weather i've been itching for weather like this all summer and like i've been telling you guys clearly you see that i'm in a knit i'm in my celine teddy neck today but the weather in new york just completely switched up so it's like 60 beginning of september and it's like super chilly already which i'm not complaining about but all that means is that it's gonna be more than likely a really brutal winter in nyc i was thinking that today now that we're seeing the weather really switch up why don't we just do a transitional outfit vlog and i'll show you guys different ways of styling transitional outfit pieces and we'll better prepare ourselves for this wonky weather because it's just literally been all over the place. Per usual, I'm gonna go grab my coffee real quick because I have yet to have my coffee for today and I have yet to have breakfast. So I'm gonna go grab that. We're gonna head back to the office and we're gonna get to these transition outfits. I'll break down my full outfit for you guys once I grab my coffee. So I'll check back in in a minute. Good morning, people. It is a new day, clearly. I'm wearing my loungewear. I'm gonna sleep in a really cozy Ralph Lauren black t-shirt. It's pretty oversized. And I'm wearing my safe khaki shorts. Like we were talking about in the car yesterday, I had to go do so many errands and I was just running around all over the place. So I didn't actually get a chance to fully break down my fit. But we're gonna get into transitional outfits since the weather has been pretty much like chilly but it's also like hot, so it's going back and forth. But since it has been getting a lot breezier, we're definitely gonna jump into different ways that you guys can style your clothing, your wardrobe right now with the pieces, just layering and trying different things since right now we're in September. It is starting to get a little bit cold, which it's gonna be like a brutal winter, especially in New York, since it is starting to get pretty chilly already. But we're gonna get into yesterday's fit because obviously I'm not wearing it right now. And it is all right here. Little bundle that's from another outfit. I was wearing my Celine Teddy. Let's go like this. I was wearing my Celine Teddy cardigan, safe khaki t-shirt, ripped denim, and my Celine sneakers. But we're gonna jump into that right now. So this was the full fit from yesterday. I will insert the Instagram picture right here for all the people who haven't already seen it or don't follow me on Instagram. Definitely go check my Instagram out and follow me on IG. So here's the fit pic right on the side. But since we are transitioning into chillier weather, it's good to have like those pieces that are right in the middle that you can, you know, wear with both shorts, jeans, pants, and just pretty much get away with different types of outfits, the different variations of outfits. And you don't feel like you're always wearing the same thing. So one of my favorite pieces to have are cardigans. This one happens to be my fall winter 19 Celine Teddy cardigan. If you guys don't know, I did picked this up about a year ago something like that it was a while ago but if you haven't seen that video also check that video out one of my favorite pieces just because the red is so vibrant has a lot of details you can see the gold on the buttons like this you can see it. just all the little details it's just amazing it's a cashmere wool blend very comfortable it's very warm but also if it is chilly you're not going to be like sweating and it's not a super heavy piece something that i love to this use and break out during like fall when it's starting to get a little bit chillier and then you could also obviously layer it underneath a leather jacket as we approach winter i wore the celine teddy cardigan my ray-ban red aviator sunglasses the flash i love these these are amazing safe khaki charcoal t-shirt custom adp a denim project by myself denim and there is another variation of these on the web store so definitely check that out and then my celine triumph sneakers in the white and red for a long time i forgot that i even had these so as I was digging through my sneakers, I saw that I had them and broke them out. Plus that they paired up perfectly with the cardigan and just fully tied in the whole fit together. But we're gonna break out some of my favorite pieces. I'm gonna show you guys and then we're gonna style them. So let's jump into some of the first pieces. All right guys, one of the key items that I already showed you before, you guys have seen this multiple times, my Celine Teddy cardigan. This is the fall winter 19 piece runaway piece just in general cardigans are to me one of the best transitional pieces that you could have you can't style it with shorts you could wear it with long jeans leather pants trousers and it's just 
something that really dresses and jazzes up an outfit. Honestly, one of the best layering pieces, especially when it is a little bit chillier in the day, in the afternoon, and you do want something on. You might not want a hoodie, you might not want a full jacket, but a cardigan is one of those pieces that is great for layering. I have a couple different variations, which we're gonna get into. This one from Celine happens to be one of my favorites. You guys saw me wearing it in the previous clips and in multiple vlogs. Definitely a little bit more on the investment piece side just because the Celine one is a little bit more pricey. Jumping into the next piece, it's a little bit more cost effective. Still something that's classic, still something that's casual, but investment wise, if you guys do want to have something of like a statement piece, I think that the Celine is a great option. Just a crazy piece with a ton of Really intricate details, as you guys can see the buttons, really beautiful gold plated buttons with like the crest detailing, the knit details all throughout, show you down the collar. Cardigans in general, but the Celine Teddy cardigan is one of my favorites. Now jumping into another cardigan that is my favorite. I have worn this in a couple of vlogs, so you guys probably have seen it or on my IG. This one is just a really clean APC gray one. This one happens to be full cashmere. So it's super, super soft, very breathable. So for transitional seasons, for days that are breezier, these are just like key pieces just for like layering. If you guys, again, don't wanna be in a full jacket and you wanna just be in something that's cozy, but something that dresses your outfit up a little bit more, takes the outfit to a different level. Cardigans are a great way to do that. I like to have a couple. I don't have a black one. I think that that's probably next on my to get list. I do have this gray one. The gray one tends to go with pretty much everything in my closet also. And then I also have the Celine sequin one. I have another style vlog lined up for you guys, which I'm gonna break it back out, but it will be heavily in the next couple of vlogs. So I figured, let me just show you guys these for this video. Cardigans are just a great way to style up an outfit and just another way just to stay warm. You could style it with shorts as I did. Jumping into what I feel is one of the super essential pieces that you should have during transitional weather periods is Western jackets, or in other words, denim jackets are for the most part cut in this Western style. I have them in a variety of different materials, different fabrics as you guys know this is one of my favorite styles of jackets and i just feel like for those transitional periods it's one of the most stylish pieces you can have in your wardrobe this western denim jacket happens to be from celine this one is the slightly distressed one so as you can see on the collar it has a little bit of distressing it also has it on some of the pockets and throughout the jean jacket but i just feel like the western denim jacket is one of my favorites just because it's just a great piece for layering even when it starts to get colder during the winter, I like to layer a denim jacket or a Western style jacket underneath my heavier coat, just so that it gives that extra pop of color and that extra little splash of like fabric underneath another overcoat or underneath a leather jacket. But during the fall, it's great just because you could throw it over a t-shirt. It's very, very stylish. It's very classic, such a classic piece. So I love to have a couple of jean jackets. So like I said, this one just happens to be from Celine. Show you a couple of the other choices that I picked that are just a little bit more friendly as we transition into the fall winter. Another great transitional piece to have. The color alone is just perfect for going into fall. It's just such a friendly color with everything in the wardrobe. As you guys can see, I styled it over a t-shirt and I also styled it with some leather pants. For those breezier days, I wouldn't say like 80 degree weather or 70 degree weather, maybe in the 60s. Throw on some leather pants, throw on this caramel jacket, even the jean jacket that I showed you guys before. It's just a great layering piece and also just a great color of jacket just to kind of play around with different pieces. Lightweight, but still something that'll keep you warm. Definitely love this Acme Caramel Western jacket. It's one of my favorites in my collection. I have definitely gotten so much use out of this. I like to layer these pieces underneath my overcoats for pops of color. A cool picture on the side of me layering it underneath one of my overcoats. It's just another great piece that you guys can get a lot of use out of going into winter and going into fall. So definitely have a couple different Western jackets that you can layer and just have fun with. Something with a little bit more texture. This is one of the best corduroy jackets that I've ever come across. The cord is super, super thin. I'm gonna try to go up close so you guys can see. So the cord is super, super thin. The jacket has an amazing weight, but I never feel hot in it. I always can use this if it is chilly out. And then the color is so beautiful. I don't know if it's gonna pick up on camera, but it's almost like a brownish black. So maybe like a, I guess the perfect 
name color would be like a dust, like a dust brown, super unique. So in certain lighting, it looks brown and I'll include the picture I use on my Instagram. It's kind of captured in a brownish light, but then probably right now it's looking more gray or charcoal black. Absolutely love the Save Khaki corduroy denim jacket. Cord jackets are not only great just for lightweight purposes and also keeping you warm, but it is such an amazing texture to kind of pair up with denim and leather. So in the style video, you guys will see how the texture of it really like pops on the outfit. It's a lot different than always just wearing a jean jacket or always just wearing a leather jacket. I do recommend having a corduroy jacket in your collection. It is something really different and just the texture alone sets you apart from everybody else. So this one happens to be from Safe Khaki. I'm pretty sure that they probably did a new rendition by this time. So if I do find that one, I will link it in the description box for you guys or something very similar. So that is going to wrap up this vlog for today. Let me know below what transitional pieces you guys have been using. I know that in New York, the weather has been pretty wonky. So I've been back and forth between jean jackets, breaking out some of my leather jackets, the cardigans, and back to shorts. So I really don't know what's up with this weather, but I feel like a brutal winter is on the horizon. So everybody gear up with your outerwear. Outerwear season is approaching and I can't wait. As always, if you are new to this channel, welcome again. My name is Ariel. I do men's luxury fashion and lifestyle content. Definitely hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, drop me some comments below, letting me know what you guys thought of this video. Definitely check me out on Instagram for daily fit pics and reels. See you guys in the next vlog. Later guys, thank you for watching. See you next time.